Hey, how's everybody doing? I see we've already got two viewers in here. Who all is here? Uh, so this is my first time, first time streaming. Um, Draven Wolf, are you here? If if you are here, uh, you and me should play Dota Two sometime. I just recently started playing that. Uh, so yeah, this is my first time streaming. Um, I'm gonna be streaming whenever I can. Uh, I don't have any kind of set schedule yet. Um, I'm also recording this so that I can post it on YouTube. So if you're watching this on YouTube, I will be streaming occasionally on Twitch. Uh, it's just twitch.tv and then my username is Z3R01400. So I haven't opened the game yet because I wanted to make sure the stream is running okay and everything, which it seems like it is. Um, if my microphone or anything is or if the game is too loud, just let me know, and I can I can turn that down because I don't know how the how the mix is on that yet. It works fine for YouTube, but I, this is my first time streaming, so I don't know how it'll work on Twitch. So I got the game coming up here, but yeah, I've got Dota 2, uh, Dyson Sphere program. It's a pretty new game. Uh, Terratech. Farming Simulator, Grand Theft Auto 5, Gold Rush. I've got all kinds of games on my account, so if anyone wants to see any of those, uh, just send me a message on here on Twitch and let me know. So hopefully you guys can hear the game sound. <laughs> anyone has commented in the stream I can't see it so let me check on my phone real quick I'm record I'm uh, controlling the recording through my phone as well so let's see <laughs> wanted to uh, do some races and maybe chat a little on stream um, there's a lot of people on Facebook I haven't seen in quite a while so it'd be nice to talk to some of you guys um, I lost where I was for a second so yeah I've I've played uh, the crew too quite a lot I've basically already beaten the game I mean there really is no not really much of an ending but I've done the majority of the races and everything um, I mainly like to do the drift races I've got a few drift cars here um, my main drift car is this Z right here I really like to use it. I'll go ahead and set it as my favorite. And I might do the uh, do the summit here. For anyone who hasn't played um, the crew two, the summit is like the ranked stuff. Okay, uh, game is loud. 
Let's see here. Speakers. There we go. Is that better? I looks like I just need one vehicle for the for the summit. But anyway, uh, anyone who hasn't played or seen the crew two, uh, the summit is like the online races where you compete with other other players in the leaderboard to get these these prizes here. And I there's only one required vehicle. I've got seven hundred thousand cash, so I may be able to to buy that. Let's go into this escape here. Alright, I'm not very good at escapes, especially ones in boats. My boat isn't really that fast. Let me know if the, uh, the sound is okay, because the game is pretty loud for me. Dang! Oh wow, I am doing awful. Let's retry that. Wow. Like I said, I'm terrible with boats on here. I may just try, <laughs> try something else. Uh, sound good and everything. Uh, I'll turn the game down just a little bit more, just in case, because I can't turn my microphone up anymore. Hopefully the game isn't isn't going to be way too loud. So I'll go ahead and do this aerobatics mission. I'm a little bit better at these. I'm not the greatest, but... Let's see, where's the next one? Oh, well. I am doing terrible right now. I should have got on here a little bit before the stream and practiced. Could just be because I'm doing a stream. I might just be a little bit nervous since I've never streamed before. So it's making me suck at the game. actually finished one. <laughs> oh wow, my score is so low on that. Let's see, a hovercraft one. This is a live extreme one, so this one will be multiple different vehicles. These races are pretty cool. It uh, it switches your vehicle throughout the race, depending on what vehicles you've chosen. I think I'm going to go with the DeLorean. Ah, oh, there's a boat part too. And off-road. Silverado or the Nomad. I think I'll go with the Nomad. It has a little bit better grip. Welcome to the Gulf Coast, where we're getting ready for the Can second I skip stop this? on the live extreme tour. No, Last it's not going to let me skip this. Streets. This time, we're also going to go wild. Hopefully the game isn't too laggy either, because I am recording this as well as streaming it. And I know that just recording by itself can sometimes make it a little bit laggy. It's not laggy on my end, but it could be, it could end up being a little laggy in the stream. So sorry for that if it is. I don't really have the greatest computer.
Oh, I missed the checkpoint. Yeah, most of my vehicles on here are pretty fast. Since, like I said, I've basically beaten the game already. So all, almost all of my vehicles are fully upgraded. And they're getting some giant-sized action. We're seeing the best from our drivers now. The moment when they're upping their game. It's going to be a gladiator match out there. Yeah, if, uh, if anyone watching this on stream right now or in YouTube has uh, any ideas they'd like to see on games to play during stream or or on YouTube videos, just let me know and I'll, I'll see about doing that. Because I, I sit around and play games all the time anyway, so I'd like to start start recording a little bit and just interact with people maybe make make some new friends and play on stream with some other people it's time for us to switch up the competition i'd like to play games on my playstation and and record it as well but i need to get a uh capture device to be able to do that and those things are just stupid expensive the one i've been looking at i think is like 300 dollars. but eventually i'll get one and i'll be able to stream or make videos with with my playstation because i've got a lot of games on playstation too i could play playstation the switch um my, my PS3 just recently broke. I just thought about that. So I may need to get a new PS3. Yeah, I need to work on my boat driving skills here. Hopefully I'll be able to finish that uh, that escape. Okay, it doesn't seem to be lagging. That's good. Uh, the uh, YouTube videos usually seem to lag a little bit. Like you can kind of notice it skipping a little bit when you watch the video. At least I do, probably because I I made it. Some other people probably don't notice that. Oh. Maybe I should have gone with the Silverado. It would slide around these turns a little more. Like I said, the Nomad has a lot of a lot of grip, but it doesn't really turn that sharp. Oh, also, I, I just recent or not recently, a couple of months back, when it first came out, I got I got, uh, I got a game called Second Extinction, which it's an online multiplayer game. So maybe I could play that with uh, with people who like to watch the streams and stuff. We could just play together and stream. Because that that game's pretty fun, but it's it's a lot better with uh, with people you know. So it, it'd be nice to meet meet some people in streams and stuff, and play games with people, and just chill and chat, have a good time.
That's 64,000 points on there. That's not terrible. But on uh, on PC, it's almost impossible to get up to the up to the platinum on here because so many people cheat on PC. It's just ridiculous. They'll cheat and get their scores ridiculously high so that no one else can beat them. So I've I've never been able to get platinum. I've I've heard that it's a lot easier on on consoles to get up to platinum. Man, there's a lot of trees here. Well, it said completed. I'm gonna end up getting a terrible score on it, but at least I'll complete it. And here comes the red, red circle. I think I can live with that. I'm terrible with the boats. What did I get on that? 13,000. Wow. Man, it looks like this has a lot of boat stuff on it. Hovercraft. Those are, those are awful to use. They're almost impossible to steer because they like to slide a lot. missed that one. Missed another one. The score wasn't too bad on this. Let's see. How's my summit score, though? Ah, uh, that's not too bad, but I usually do pretty well in the summits. This time, I'm definitely not. Uh, I'll go ahead and try this hovercraft one. My hovercraft is pink. I think I've got a gold one too, but this one's better. Go, go, go! Yeah, with the with the hovercrafts, you have to hit your nos a lot because they like to slide sideways, and the nos helps to get you back on track. I had trouble finding the place. Remote's how we like it. Thanks for lending us your hovercraft. Uh, I see we got another viewer. Hi to the new viewer. Hope you're doing well. Everything all cool. Just chatting and streaming. like driving a crap it feels like adrenaline and that's what i'm here for yeah that guy's right these do feel like driving a crab oh turned a bit too sharp there Oh, this is a long race. Not even halfway done with it yet. I These hovercraft like races usually are a little bit long too. Handle this well in swamps. That's that's what makes the handling even worse. The long races gives you a lot more chances to mess up. But at least in the summits, the difficulty is always set to the lowest difficulty 
so you don't really have to worry about the other or the NPC drivers. Usually, depending on what what the race is, I like to set my difficulty to ace all the way to the highest. Gives it a little bit more of a challenge, but even on the harder hardest difficulty in this game, the the NPCs aren't really much of a challenge. But with playing PvP online, the game never wants to load. It's always stuck in the matchmaking screen. So even if you are able to race with other people, it takes like 20 or 30 minutes just to load a single race. And then that race will take like less than five minutes to finish. So you're stuck waiting another half hour for matchmaking. Like the view? You know, I think there's just not as many people view, playing this game as there was when it first came out. That's why we like to share our toys. Oh, please. Get a room, you two. So it just ends up taking the matchmaking forever oh, online. You folk are a blast. Thanks. Which you is probably like why I'm not not going like to end up needed. doing any online races with this game. Okay, I got an awesome score on that. I thought I did terrible. I wasn't really even paying much attention to it. 115,000. We'll do this other aerobatics one. Oh, it's forcing me to choose this plane? Ugh. I don't think I have any upgrades on this plane. This may not turn out very well. Oh yeah, it's definitely slow. Uh, wants me to do low altitude. Roll. Up oh, two rolls. Okay. And then gotta fly under a bridge. Yeah, this plane is definitely slow. After this race is over, I may have to just go and upgrade it and then come back to this because I don't know how well I'll be able to do with the plane being so slow. I fly under two bridges now. I can do that over here and that'll get me a little bit of the low altitude. I got me all of the low altitude. I'll go up a little higher so I can do the loop. Freestyle. I'm about to fall into the water here. Oh, it wasn't giving me low altitude for being that low. That's a little bit lame. Another loo. vertical up and then an outside loop yeah this plane's definitely too slow to be doing stunts with objective completed Got 10 seconds left on this.
Yeah, I definitely didn't get a very good score on it. Depending on how bad it is, I may go upgrade that plane and then try it again. Yeah, 40,000. That's kind of bad. Was that even my plane? Or did it force me to have a different one? It was this one, wasn't it? No, that would have been my plane. Oh yeah, this thing has no upgrades on it. I won't do that. I'll just go to another one. I don't want to be doing nothing but uh, airplane ones. Let's see. Hypercar. Vehicle forced. What's it going to make me use? Bugatti Devo Ember. This is the new vehicle, I think. Yeah, this is the one you can win in the in this summit. So I'm probably not gonna win this this car. I've got a few Bugattis already though. I'm kind of tired of the Bugattis. I want to get me a different hypercar. These Bugattis are nice, but they all kind of look the same. This one's really nice though. I like the colors on it with that green. Oh man, I'm not used to this car. Seems like this is going to be a long race, too. It's already or only at 5%. I almost missed that turn. Thankfully, I looked down at the map just in time. I'd really like to win this Bugatti. It is nice, but that's not going to happen. There's no way I'll be able to get to Platinum, especially with all the boat stuff. And with it being on PC, like I said, there's so many hackers on this game that make it impossible to get to Platinum in the summits. The developers need to fix that, work on their uh, whatever they use for people who cheat, just ban all the cheaters. Seems like that's pretty much all who plays this game anymore is just the cheaters. Some of the scores on the leaderboards are absolutely insane. There are some in like the uh, the top speed leaderboards where people have gone like 600 miles an hour. And the fastest you can get to on here is maybe 350. I know my uh, my drag car only goes about 350 at its top speed and it's fully upgraded so there's no way that people are getting like five and six hundred miles an hour on those I did notice a little bit of lag just there, so hopefully the stream isn't lagging too bad.
in this race, it is long. I probably wouldn't have done it if I knew this race was so long. It's looking like it's going to take like 15 minutes to finish it. Hopefully there's a lot of long straightaways so I can just go top speed. Just finish the race quicker. I may go ahead and just close out of this race. I don't know. It's a little long. I wasn't really planning on doing this long of a race. I wanted to kind of just do a bunch of short races. And I'm probably going to have to cut off this stream at once it hits at about an hour since because since I'm recording it as well um, when my computer stores the recording it stores it in the same uh, the same hard drive that my uh, system software is installed in and that hard drive only has about 11 or 12 gigabytes of space and an hour long video will probably be around nine gigs. So I'll have to cut it off at about a at about an hour. That way it will actually be able to save the video for YouTube. Yeah, I am noticing the game lagging just a little bit, so hopefully the video isn't lagging too bad. If, if you can even notice it lagging, you probably don't. I just notice it because I'm the one playing. Let's see what's the stream there say. It says I'm getting 30 frames a second, so. And it's a solid 30. It's not going down any. I'm just worried about it. Oh, I'm just worried about it lagging because I know some people are really, really picky about lag in videos, and they'll be be trolls about it and be like, "Oh, well, just get you a better system, and it won't lag like that." Troll a little low. And uh. I just don't want people to be doing that, so that's that's kind of why I'm worrying about uh, worrying about the lag so much. I mean, when I watch other people's videos and streams, I really don't don't care about whether they're lagging or not. But some people just care too much about that, which is what. So that's why I'm worrying about it. I may go ahead and cut this race short. I kind of want to get into some drifting. I'll do my uh, my favorite drift race on this game. I actually made a video recently of that race, and I got really lucky in that video because uh, I played it on the hardest difficulty, and I managed to do it without messing up a single time. It was a, a perfect race. Hopefully I can do that on stream. That'd be pretty awesome. Yeah, I think I'm gonna 
end up cutting this race short. I'll just go back to the summit. That's taken way too long. I wasn't planning on doing any long races. All right, so yeah, I'll go ahead and back out of this. And I want to go do that drift race that I was talking about. Here's my drift car, by the way. It's a 370Z Nismo edition. I'd like to have this car in real life. It's my dream project car. So, let's see. Activities. Drift. Airport Terminal D. This is this is my all-time favorite race in this game. I wish they would add more drift stuff because there's there's really not even that many drift cars. Like I'll show you here, the cars drift cars that I have right here are these are the only good ones in the game. It's the uh, 370Z. Oh, never mind. This is not the Nismo edition. The other one is my Nismo edition. Uh, the Viper, the NSX, RX-7, there's the Nismo edition, and then the Evo X. These are the only good drift cars in the game. The rest of them are like supercars and stuff. Like, why would you have a supercar as a drift car? <laughs> they need to get some, oh, some more Nissans and stuff in here, like actual drift cars. But the, the developers are mainly working on the summits and all that, so I doubt they'll add more, more drift vehicles into the game. Hopefully I can get a perfect score on this. It's raining right now though, so it's a little more slick than what I'm used to. I'm already not doing very good on it. Yeah, mainly I play this game for the drift races. I just like doing the drifting. Uh, eventually I'm probably gonna buy a set of Corsa, because it's, from what I've heard and seen, it's got uh, a lot of drift stuff on it, and I really like doing the drifting. I've never done it in real life, though. I'd really like to. It'd be fun. I'm not the best at it on games, but I am. I'm pretty decent at it. So I like I like doing these just because they're, they're more fun than the other races, especially since with the other races you're against NPCs, and the NPCs on this game are just terrible. Like, they're, they're so slow most of the time they can't even keep up with you on the hardest difficulty. So it's just not much of a challenge. But with these drift races, it does give you a little bit of a challenge. Like, up at the top there, I've got to get to 270,000 points to be able to beat this race, which it looks like I'm almost there. I just about hit that wall. I've gone perfect so far. Hopefully I don't hit a wall and screw it up. I think in my YouTube video I got like 318,000 points in total, so we'll see how many I get this time, see if I beat that score. I don't remember if that was a record score or not, though. 358,000? Is that a record? No, it looks like it's not a record. I was kind of hoping it would be a record. Would have been awesome if I beat my highest record on stream. Yeah, yeah. I'm going to go look at the... Uh, look at the leaderboards on that race and see what my record is. That's the world record. 
my record 385. I just got 350 something that time. So yeah, I'm gonna have to work on getting that up. I want to get it to at least 400,000 points. That would be awesome. Yeah, see that wor world up there on the left, 800,000. Like I just did perfect on that race. Well, nearly perfect, and didn't even get 400,000. So there's there's no way that person got 800,000 unless they're cheating. So we'll try Upper East Side here. Oh, look out, kitty! You're right. Yeah, look out. <laughs> I don't know if you could hear her meowing or not. She was right under my feet. Yeah, I've got a, uh, I've got a vent right under my desk, so the cats like to lay on the vent there since it's warm. They're always under my feet while I'm playing games. Uh, this is the, the race that kind of gets a little weird. Oh, I hit the wall. It gets weird where there's sections are sticking out like that I can never get the rhythm down right on this race I need to practice this track a little more the terminal D race that I just did I, I play that race all the time so I'm, I've got the rhythm down pretty well on it but I've only played this race a couple of times, so the rhythm is a little difficult for me. There we go, I think I'm kind of getting the rhythm. I've already beaten the score. I didn't put this on the highest difficulty though. just because I knew I would probably not be able to beat the highest difficulty score. Uh, I kind of lost it there and hit the wall. My phone just did something. Oh, I said I hit the wall, and for some reason, Big Speed just came up and Google searched wall. I don't even have Bixby active on my phone, so I don't know why it came up. Sorry if me saying the, the B word made it come up on your phone. <laughs> Those text or speech search things get kind of annoying when they randomly pop up out of nowhere like that. Alright, uh, let's see. I might have enough time for a couple more races. Looks like the recording's at about 45 minutes. Um, I want to switch vehicles first. I'll go with the RX-7. This is my second favorite drift vehicle on here. I love RX-7s. Yeah, the, the game's lagging quite a bit now. Let me see. Yeah, I can, I can hear my computer fans running, so they're struggling a little bit. Next time I stream, I may have to just turn the graphics settings down on the game a little bit. Because the, the graphics on this game are pretty awesome, but they do bog down my computer a little bit.
Let's see, which one this time? Red Bull Drift. Um, I think it's the Challenge North that I really suck at. So I might do that one. <laughs> Just because I suck at it. And it might be the other Red Bull one. I know one of the Red Bull ones I'm, I'm really terrible at. Can't remember whether it was north or east, though. Oh, I think it was this one. Yeah, I'm pretty sure it's it's this one that I really suck at. So we'll see how well I do on it. Oh, no, it wasn't this one. This is the other one. <laughs> This isn't the one I was thinking of. So it is west or east, whichever one that one is. I, it looks like I'm apparently terrible at this one too. The ones that like this one that aren't on a closed course are a little more difficult for me. I always end up going way too wide on my drifts. And I end up hitting the light poles and stuff. And I, I lose my drift because of it. That's one thing I don't really like about the way they do the scoring on this game. With drifting. Because in, in real life, at least I'm assuming, I've never actually really been to a drift event or anything. But usually... People think it's awesome when you tap the wall or something, but on here, if you touch anything at all while you're drifting, it makes your your combo go away, like it stops the combo. So the scoring on this game isn't exactly realistic, but I think most games with drifting are that way. If you tap a wall or anything, it just stops your combo. I'm hitting everything now. Yeah, it looks like I'm not gonna beat this. I'm just terrible at the actual road course ones. I'm better at the enclosed ones. If I had been able to keep that drift, I probably would have had it. My score was going up pretty fast. I needed 10,000 more points. Where are my parts? Uh, oh yeah, I lost the race, duh. It's not gonna give me parts, but I lost the race. All right, um, I'll try another drift. Charity event, no, I'm not very good at that one. That one's on the docks. Uh, let's see. Mm, I'm not good at the harbor ones. Steel Forge plant. Well, no, I'll do Airport Terminal E. Airport Terminal D is the one that's my favorite. I don't think I've done E very much. I'm not not doing it on the hardest difficulty though, so maybe I'll be able to beat this one. Because I'm probably going to end the stream after this race is done. Because the recording's at 51 minutes already, so. I think I put on my scheduling that the stream was only going to be an hour as well. Godspeed. Well, don't have too much faith in me, buddy. Because I am sucking at the moment. Wow. I don't think I'm going to be able to get there.
Well, my score is going up pretty fast, so maybe I can't. Oh, no, no, no. Ah, uh, I hit the wall. And next time I stream, I'm definitely going to have to make sure I get in like an hour of practice beforehand. Because <laughs> I'm really not doing good today. Probably just where I'm nervous about streaming, though. That probably happens to everyone when they're first starting streaming. It's, it's kind of weird knowing that people are watching you play a game. That always seems to happen to me when someone's watching me play a game in person, too. I'll do amazingly when I'm by myself, but then as soon as someone's watching me, I'm just terrible at it. Looks like I beat it. I might have gotten close to 100,000 points. Oh, I hit the wall. Yeah, I got over 100,000. Awesome. Where's my car parts? Did I pass them? Yeah, they're back that way. There we go. They're just blue ones. I wish I had gotten some red ones. But I think I'm going to go ahead and end the stream slash video right there. So thanks for everyone who came to watch uh, i hope to see you again uh, i don't know when i'm going to be streaming again maybe soon maybe not um just check my profile here on twitch and i'll have it scheduled probably an hour or two in advance for the next time i stream so i hope everyone enjoyed watching i'll see you later